It is day nine for the Chad Daybell trial. We heard from five witnesses today. Local News 8's Linda Larson has been following this case since the beginning. Linda, what did you learn today? There was a lot, Todd. First, I want to tell you about a 911 call that we heard from Chad Daybell. The call was made moments after his first wife, Tammy Daybell, had died. Inside the courtroom, the defendant appeared to be emotional as the room stayed silent. Now, you'll remember Daybell is charged with murder in the death of his first wife, Tammy Daybell, and in the deaths of his then-girlfriend, Lori Vallow's children, 7-year-old Joshua J.J. Vallow and 16-year-old Tylee Ryan. Idaho prosecutors say the couple espoused strange doomsday-focused beliefs involving demonic possession and zombies to further their plan to kill the kids and Chad Daybell's previous wife and to collect life insurance and survivor benefits. Today, Daybell's attorney, John Pryor, handed Kleenex to the defendant as he listened to the 911 call. Hello, I'm Chad, the husband. Um... She's clearly dead. Um, we don't oh, know. sorry. Okay. Okay. Are you in Rexburg or because your address shows Fremont Rexburg County. address that you're in Fremont County? It's a mile past. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. Oh. <laughs> yeah, she's not even broke. An autopsy was done, not done on Tammy after her death, but the body was exhumed later and her death was then ruled a homicide.